a lot fewer executive orders. I'm not a huge fan of executive orders because I think that executive orders, especially if you have Congress, I mean, right now he's got a majority in Congress, so you should be able to pass some pretty significant laws. Um, you know, first, first order of business on an executive level. Uh, I, mean, I think a lot of what Trump is doing, you know, as far as attempting to build up the military, is correct. Uh, I think slashing regulations is correct. Uh, I think that you know, an attempt to restructure entitlements would be very high on the priority list if you're going to do it to it early in your presidency, obviously. Uh, because you're going to feel blowback for doing it. And if we don't fix the entitlement problem, then the country's the government's basically done. I mean, 80% of our budget is entitlements, essentially. Only 20% is defense. Um, yeah, I think that I, I would also be, be, I would have a basic rule. And the basic rule would be I will not sign any bill that is longer than three pages and not in plain language. I want the American people to understand what it is that people are voting for and what they're signing. I would also fire half the executive branch immediately. I would disband <laughs> not just three departments, I would disband a lot of de departments. And I won't bother naming them because oops. So, the, so, so I, I would get rid, I think that the government by executive fiat is gross. I don't think that's what the presidency was designed to do. And I would try to take structural measures to undermine the power of the federal government so that the person who came after me could not, re, could not revamp it. I would, I would devolve a lot of power to the states. I would devolve a lot of power to localities. Um, as I say, I would, I would try to break the public sector unions as fast as possible because I think that they're bankrupting the country. Um, and a lot of the, the, the stuff I could do inside the executive branch would be stuff addressed to the executive branch. So it wouldn't be addressed to you know, areas that Congress has already spoken on. But you know, I, I would disband the EPA. I would disband the Department of Education. I would disband the Department of Energy. If Congress wants to pass laws along those lines, Congress can damn well pass laws along those lines. But the idea that a bunch of unelected bureaucrats are super giant experts in all this stuff, and they get to make all the regulations and rules without ever having to be exposed to the public eye, I think that's really gross. So that would be, as president, I think that's the first job of the president. The president really has two jobs under the Constitution, right? It's to enforce the laws and to make sure that we have national security. Those are really his two big jobs under the Constitution, and those would be the two that I take seriously. I would be maybe the first president in history trying to undermine the power of the executive branch on behalf of the legislature uh, and, uh, and simultaneously strengthen the military on behalf of uh, national security. Shapiro 2020! <laughs> <laughs> well, Maybe 2024. <laughs> well, thank you very much.